What is up, YouTube? My name is Ghostface, and welcome back to Shadow Mist, our Lucario amiibo. So, I did end up changing his stats a little bit. He's still an attack type, I didn't change anything on that. And his personality is still enthusiastic. I did change his abilities, though. We have Aura Attack, Trade-Off Ability, and Critical Health Attack. Now, these are things that a lot of you pointed out that you want to see on Shadow Mist, so I kind of evened it out and gave him this for the final product. And I don't know how I feel about having a trade-off ability. The idea of having him start at 30% is decent for Lucario. I just really hope, like, Shadow Mist can actually stay alive long enough to actually keep it. Because Lucario, as a character, is not that heavy. But I'm going to try it and see how it turns out, because I haven't actually seen what he can do with these abilities now, so hopefully he actually turns out good with them. Because again, if I can kill him early enough with that 30%, that might be an issue. There it is. I don't know why it didn't start for a minute. Damn it. I'll tell you, going from Incineroar to Lucario is such a change in fighting styles. Ooh, he was faster than me. Alright. You know, for an attack type, you're playing very defensive. Defensive, and he's getting better with the recovery, that's good. At least he didn't crash into the stage again. Ah, oh, if he made that back, that would have been amazing. Also, someone pointed out in the last video, I talked about how taunting can get Lucario as a character more aura. And someone actually pointed out, I was totally off. That was actually Project M. That wasn't in, in an official Smash game. Oh, that's gonna kill me. Oh no, I made it over! just to get hit by a back air. But yeah, the... Ah, I say that term loosely of, like, not official, because honestly, I believe Project M should be considered, like, an actual Smash game at this point. Because correct me if I'm wrong, we did have a Project M tournament sponsored by Nintendo directly. I might be off, because it was a good two years ago now, I think. But it was right before this game came out. So I think Nintendo actually sponsored it themselves. So at that rate, I consider it actually canon. I didn't think I was going to kill for a minute. <laughs> he slowed down a little bit. He's playing defensive, though. He's not actually, like, getting in my grill whatsoever. That damage is pretty good, though. And I know on the second stock, I think it was, I killed him pretty early with the final smash. I might boost his defense more. I just want to try out a few more things before I actually do that. Oh, where's... Why am I blanking? I'm looking for... Oh! That took me a lot longer than I wanted. And... Uh, I gotta really work on this one later on after he's level 50. Because I'm aware I'm not the best Lucario player. But I do have a decent... Backbone idea. Of a few things he can do, so... 
Ooh, good counter. All right, I deserve that. God damn it. He's better at hitting the stage than I am. Sorry, collecting to the ledge at least. Not hitting the stage, that's what I do. I should have took that landing. Good throw. I haven't seen him do that often. And the counter. He's definitely picking up on that. Okay, that was a weird hitbox, but I'll let you have it. Super dead. <laughs> if Lucario can get him right on the edge, there's no way they're gonna come back. Unless if they're a heavyweight, there's no way I can see characters like Mario or Luigi coming back. Lucario actually has a really smart AI when I really observe. Because he... He's playing defensively as an attack type, and that's super dead. <laughs> Obliterated. Even that alone, like... Knowing how to approach me in between the stages of the battlefield. I almost don't want to kill you with that. I want you to learn other ways of attacking, but to be fair, he has to learn. He has to learn the final smash. He has honestly a really good final smash, and at least he's actually angling it. Because if he had the laser and didn't angle it whatsoever, he would not do anything at all. It's actually really good timing for training Lucario, too, because now I am I might be off on the timing because I just found out, but in the Pokemon anime running right now, Ash actually gets a Riolu, so he'll have a Lucario by the end of it. Hopefully, because that'd be really ironic. <laughs> that'd be really awful if he had the baby version of Lucario and it didn't evolve. I guess it wouldn't be the first time either, because he's done that a couple times. Damn it, I aimed the wrong way. Alright, that was cheeky. He dodges everything, but just gets right behind me and grabs me. He's learning too, because I can't shield that. Ooh, not today! Down air with the awkward hitting. Okay. I deserve that. <laughs> I was at 168 or so. Oh, if he hit me into the stage, I would have been screwed on that. Can I dodge that? No, I cannot. 
Oh, right, he actually might. He's getting really good at perfect shielding. That is amazing. I'm really, like, when amiibos pick up on the shielding quickly and just keep repetitively doing it, it is so goddamn amazing to me. Just because I, as a person, am really bad at doing it consecutively, especially for teaching methods. So if the AI is smart enough to just learn from himself and do it, it makes my life so much easier. could have dodged, but he knew better. It's just either way I was going to take the stock. Oh, you almost had me with that. How did I not connect? You're not getting your final smash. There we go. He almost had me. If he got his final smash, I was screwed. Not today. No, no. So he's picking up quick. He's a little sneaky, Fox man thing. I don't even know what to call Lucario when you really think about it. <laughs> but he almost got me. He had me on the ropes extremely. I'm gonna try and actually... I'm gonna go for Battlefield again. Because I feel like this is gonna be the match where he actually beats me. I'm hoping. Because if that's the case, we can go to tech school in the next video. And then I could just fight him as the roster and we'll be all set. Him and Sunriser, my god, you guys are actually, like, really smart with your AI. Go ahead, charge. He's falling into the category of never using his projectile, though. And I do not appreciate that, sir. Oh, I learned down smash. special because I panicked. That was a good hit, alright. <laughs> Thought I was gonna hit him. I'm landing Shadow Ball or Aura Sphere. Why is it not? Why are you not picking up on that? Okay, <laughs> just punched me right in the face and just obliterated. That's... Uh, I, I was actually afraid of that killing. Yeah. 
Don't taunt, you're losing. Okay, you might have room to taunt, because he's getting a lot of power. At least he's shielding it? God. No, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to final smash, because I want him to actually... See, that was good. He read the roll. And he, now he's just taunting me. I'm not gonna win because of Final Smash. I'm not doing that. If he does it, that's fine. Because he learned how to do it. Oh, this is gonna hurt. <laughs> okay, that was... That was nice. I'm not even mad. I could have won if I used Final Smash, but I chose not to. And he destroyed me on the last stock. That's good. He is actually learning, and I'm proud. Because training Lucario is definitely difficult, because I'm not the best Lucario. But he's turning out pretty goddamn good. Aggressive nature, that's... God, it's such a default nature, but I'm fine having it for Shadow Mist in particular. Because overall, he's definitely going to be a hard-hitting fighter, and it really shows. Because if I give him more boost to his attack, he might be able to break shields more consecutively, but... I'm going to let it be for now. If you guys liked the video, please leave a like! And if you want to see more of Shadow Mist in action, then please feel free to subscribe to my channel for more amiibo content, and if you do, we will see you in the next video.